Hey guys, it's Heather from Calva Plan, and in this video, we are going to be flipping through April in my catch all planner. So, I'm really excited um, to show you guys how I used my planner this month. Um, so, in this video, we're going to flip through my April planner for my catch all, my social media, and my faith. And then I'm going to show you how to switch it all around and get ready for May in this planner. So this is my catch-all. Uh, this was the week of Easter. These were stickers from my seasonal book that came out last year. I really loved how that spread turned out. This spread was using the blue florals from my Roy G. Biv book. I really loved this one as well. These were stickers from my fourth Kelva fan box. So it's kind of crazy because most of this month I actually think... I think for the first time ever, every single week in this planner, I used my own stickers, which it's crazy to think that I have that many stickers now, but I really loved how this one turned out. I thought, I think these colors are just really pretty and elegant. Um, and then this was using my new Bold Florals book. There's still a few of these books left on my website, so you can grab one if you have it. And these stickers are also from my Bold Florals sticker book. So I really loved that spread. Then we're gonna go to my social media spread or my social media planner. I use this to help me plan YouTube, Instagram, Patreon, um, my custom names. Like I use this for all kinds of, it's basically my work planner. Um, I One thing I've been doing the past couple of months is I made my own left side and I print it every week and I put it in and then that way it's just super custom to what I need each month or each week. And then this again is using my stickers from my box that released in April. This one, this was the week that I was out of town. And so I didn't use it as much because I went out of town on Wednesday. Um, and I got most of my work done before I left. So that's why this week is kind of bare because I was out of town. And then this was two weeks ago. Um, and one thing I've started doing is when I have these empty ones, that's usually when I do reels on Instagram. And then this was last week. Um, I haven't, I've sold out of these custom name orders, so I didn't have any of those last week. I need to relist those on my website. But these stickers were from the Happy, one of the Happy Planner's new teacher packs. Okay, and then this is my faith planner. Um, I This is an undated planner. I cover up where they have the prompts, and then I just use it. And this is the book I'm reading right now. It's called Woven. If you've ever done Angie Smith's study called Seamless, this one goes pretty well with Seamless. It just kind of walks you through um, the basic story of the Bible. I don't want to say basic because it's very intricate, but like the base story, I guess, is maybe what I'm trying to say. Um, but basically, I read a chapter each week. This chapter, this week, I think I read two, and I just take notes from some of my favorite parts and I write them in those spots. Um, I really loved this one with the flowers up the edge. I love this one. If y'all don't know this about me, one of my favorite color combinations is pink and orange. I love it, which is funny because I don't really like the color orange, but I love it when it's paired with pink. And so I love how this one turned out. I just think it's so pretty. And then this was, I think two weeks ago. Nope. There were so many weeks in May, in April. This is April. Like, I think there was like one, two, three, four, I think there were five weeks. So the planner just, it felt like we used these this month forever, which is fine. Um, and then this was last week. So I really loved the pink with the green. I thought that was really pretty. And so that is my planner for April. So what I do now is I pull out my faith planner my social media planner and then I also pull out my catch-all planner which is here and this planner okay so this can go over here because basically what I do first is I take April and I take it and I put it back on the original discs because I'm basically building my planner back to, together. So like here, this is January and these four months are completed because I'm basically building it back. Um, so then I'm going to set this over here for a minute. I'm going to pull out what I call my prep planner and I'm going to go 
to May in my prep printer. Pull this month out. And pop this into my catch-all. Then I'm going to take my prep planner back and I'm going to pull out June. And then I can put this away. I keep this in a cart next to my desk. But then I need to pull out this one because I like to use these dividers. I think they're prettier. So I'm going to pull out June and June. And I'm going to put these in here. And then I'm going to take this May one. And I'm going to put it here. Okay, so I'm going to set that aside for a minute. Now I'm going to go to my social media planner. And I'm going to go here to June. Okay, and I'm going to take April out of this planner. Put it back on the original discs. See, and now I have four months of completed planners. Then I pull out my prep planner and I go here to May. Pull that out. Put it in here. I'm going to take my prep planner. I pull out June from this one and I put it in here okay and then I can put this away until next month and then the next thing I do is I go to my faith planner pull these off put it on here Then I go over here, pull this off, put it here, and then I take my next month off and put it in my prep planner. So then my prep planner, I actually keep it on my desk right in front of me. That way if I need to pull it out to write anything, I can. And then this, I have now turned my main planner into my planner for May. So here's my May monthly, my spread for this week, my social media, my faith, and I'm ready to go for May. And that's pretty much how I get it all ready to go. So if you like this video, I hope you hit the like button. If you want to see more of my videos, hit that subscribe button and happy planning.